welcome to the Josh and Ashley Show, and we greet you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, our Lord, our Savior, our Redeemer, our Amen. Healer, and our soon coming King. Amen. I believe He's coming, don't you? Uh, absolutely. And you know what? The Bible says um, that there, there is a, there's a harvest that is ready to be picked. Mm -hmm. there, is a, there is a harvest that's, that's ripened and ready. But the scripture says that the laborers yeah. are few. And we need people today Amen. to step up to the plate. If we ever needed preachers, if we ever needed singers. Now listen, I got to be honest with you. I, I'm, I'm a little hardcore on this. <laughs> We've got a lot of preachers, but we don't have any preachers. I'm talking well, about we need some preachers Amen. of the gospel who will preach the truth and will preach thus saith the Lord and will preach the word of God. And we need singers today, anointed by God. And we need preachers and singers, and we need saints and witnesses, mm -hmm. and we need people that are ready mm -hmm. to go under the harvest and work. Yeah. You know, never, you know, we're talking, we've been talking about this season that we're in and this generation that we're in and how people are seem to have been staying away from the church. Uh, and those people that are away from the church probably are never going to come back to Amen. the church. Just the reality of that. Mm -hmm. But the truth is, is that there's enough lost people out there. If those who were in the church never come back to the church, it's the greatest it's time we've ever yeah. had because we can go get the lost. And we need to do that now Amen. because I believe God is is getting ready to stir it. I believe the gifts is stirring. I believe the spirit is stirring. I believe the preacher's heart is stirring. I believe the singer's heart is stirring. And I believe God's getting ready for something to happen that Amen. we've never seen before. We're tired of this old phony baloney. We're tired of <laughs> this old fake self-righteous uh, religious church stuff. Man, we're tired of the smoke and the lights and the fog. Listen, all of that stuff may have its proper place, but people are ready for the real Amen. thing. That's we right. need the real thing. We need it today in our lives. We need it today in our church. That's right. And that's what I'm praying. God, stir us. God, stir us. Amen. Stir up the spirit. Amen. Stir up the spirit. Stir up the spirit in us. Oh, let's sing before I get carried <laughs> away and go to preaching here today. Stir it up, Holy Ghost. Amen. That's what we need. Yeah. I feel the wind, the fire blowing. I see the clouds rolling near. Lightning flashes sets the sky glowing. <laughs>
wonderful to me It's the only name that has the power To set my spirit free So I've come to give him glory I've come to give him all the praise I've got to stand and testify And magnify his name For there's no other name like Jesus So greatly to be praised I love the name of Jesus For he washed my sin away And there is power in the name of Jesus And he's the one who died to save us There's no other name, no other name like Jesus. No other name like the wonderful name of Jesus. Amen. I've called his name so many times in the middle. shadows as I've been by the light 
Just as blessed when times were hardest I'll just lift my hands and praise him because I am so blessed. You know, Ashley, in our Josh and Ashley show, uh, we've been receiving letters and, and emails, and a lot of people have been writing us. And they've been requesting prayer. They've been asking us to pray over their needs and asking the Lord to help them, and maybe that's you today. And if you do have a prayer request or a prayer need, uh, why don't you write to us? Send us that email. We want to join in prayer with you. We want to believe God with you. Uh, we know that there are so many right now. You know, I was just talking to someone uh, the other day, and uh, they were struggling in their life in a, in a major way, uh, struggling and, and just holding on, just trying to hold on. And uh, they were looking and, and searching and, and trying to figure out how to get through what they were going through. And they didn't know where to turn and they didn't know where to go and they, they didn't know what to say. They were just in one of those places in their life. And uh, I did my best to present the gospel and to give them Jesus and to share with them what Jesus can do for them in their life. And, you know, that's all that the world is looking for today. Right. There is a void that is missing in the heart of man. And, and, and they're looking it through all kinds of means. And, and, uh, and they're looking through it through the eyes of the natural. And they're thinking that this is what I need and mm -hmm. that is what I need. And I could begin to call all of these things out. But, but maybe today it's different from what... Uh, you stand in need of it. Maybe what you're going through right now, I, I may not even call that out, but you know what you're facing and you know what you're going through. And you know the difficulties in your life. And that's why we've got to do our part yeah. in presenting this gospel. That's why we got to do our part in sharing this good news in a bad news world and offer the hope. That's what the gospel is. Right. It's the good news. And I just want to share that good, good news with you. And I want to remind you that nothing lasts forever but God. He's the only thing that lasts forever. Nothing else is going to matter at the end of all of this. All of your problems are going to vanish. All of your difficulties are going to fall by the wayside. Everything that you've, you've been facing, when Jesus comes, it's all going to be over with. And today, we're trying to do our part in presenting to you the gospel to bring you hope. And I hope today that you are being encouraged by that. And if you are, if you don't have a prayer request, just send us a note of encouragement. Send us a note of a praise report. Maybe something the Lord has done for you. Send us a note. Email us. Write us today and say, hey, I want you to know that God is blessing my life and God is touching and God is bringing me through maybe the songs that we're singing. We want to hear from you today and we want you to know that we are praying for you in whatever situation that you're dealing with. Right now is the time. This is the season. This is the day. You know, there are four seasons physically upon this yes. earth. There's winter, spring, summer, and fall. But the Bible says that the Lord has another season, right. not in the natural, but in the spirit. And it's the due season. And that's the season we're in right now. And you are due for a breakthrough and for a miracle in your life, a healing in your life. I believe that time is right now as well. Oh, Ashley, sing this song. Be an encouragement to these people today. And know, friends, that Jesus is near. Just throw your hands up and thank him today that he's right there for you. Praise the Lord. 
There are people all around us who are lost. We must reach them with the message of the cross. There cannot be too great a sacrifice. Let us heed the call from Calvary and proclaim the risen Christ. The days are few to go to all the world and share the gospel truth. No room for compromise. Standing our ground, we will obey the call. The We hope you've enjoyed the Josh and Ashley show today. And if you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, we want to invite you to know him today. It's our heart's desire. It's our prayer that we pray that we can lead you to Jesus. We can't save you, but we can lead you to the one who can change your life today. And at this very hour and at this very moment, if you will surrender your life to Christ, if the Spirit of God is tugging at your heart right now, then I want you to pray this prayer with me. And I want you to believe as we pray, this prayer cannot save you, but your faith in Jesus can turn your life around. So I want you to pray this prayer with me and believe it. Dear God in heaven, I come before you now in the name of your son Jesus. I'm asking you to forgive me of all of my sins. For I believe that God sent his son Jesus to die upon the cross. And that God raised Jesus from the dead. I believe in the cross of Christ. And I'm asking for your forgiveness. Save my soul. 
Come into my heart. Come into my life. Make me as white as snow. I'm sorry for the places I've been. I'm sorry for the things I've said and the things that I've done. Forgive me. Cleanse me and save me in Jesus' name. If you prayed that prayer today, then I believe that Jesus Christ has come into your heart. You've come to ask him and invite him to live there. And now you need to allow him to become Lord of your life today. And if you need more understanding of that, you can find more information on our website at joshandashleyfranks.com. And there's information there on a free gift that we'll give to you. Click on that little button that says free gift. And it will help you to get you started on your journey with Jesus Christ. And while you're there on our website, joshandashleyfranks.com, you'll see an email and you'll see a mailing address. Why don't you write to us and let us hear from you. If you've got a, prayer, a praise report or a prayer request, we'll take either or or both. And we'll be joining with you either in prayer and faith or in rejoicing. And then lastly, there on our website, joshandashleyfranks.com, you see it on your screen. Why don't you look and see where we're going to be? Our itinerary. Come and join us if we're in your area. Also, you can purchase our product there. You can find all of our music, CDs, DVDs, books, T-shirts, preaching CDs, soundtracks. All of that is on our website. You can learn more about the Josh and Ashley Show. We have guests from time to time, and you'll be able to learn more about them. And then, of course, you can find more information about our church, People's Tabernacle, Savannah, Tennessee. We'd love to have you come and worship with us on any given Sunday or Wednesday. And I promise you this, that People's Tabernacle Church isn't the answer, but we'll give you the answer when Amen. you get there. And his name is Jesus Christ. And that is our prayer today. Yes. And again, we love you and we thank you for watching the Josh and Ashley Show. Let's end today with a beautiful hymn of the church. I think this is appropriate to end with. Our prayer is, and let this be your prayer, Lord, keep me near the cross.
that's just 